hello everyone welcome welcome back to my channel today we are going to discuss about wireless integrated network sensor it is one of the advanced topic so what are the main function of this wireless integrated network sensor means especially this wireless integrated network sensor are used for the security purpose so it is a somewhat cheaper technology when compared to the other technologies that is radar etc so it is especially used for the security purpose so you can see what is this wireless integrated network sensor so in this particular session we are going to discuss the wins introduction that is wireless integrated network sensors introduction and uh, evolution of wins and uh, working principle and uh, system architecture node architecture sensors and servers used in the wins and digital signal processing spectrum analysis characteristics and application conclusion all these are going to discuss in this particular session so what is wins what are the applications of wireless integrated network sensor means these wireless integrated network sensors are especially used for the security purpose it is the main thing so it provides a new monitoring and control capability for monitoring borders of our country it is the advanced application of this wireless integrated network sensors by using this wireless integrated network sensor we can control we can monitor our borders okay we can easily identify stranger or some of the terrorists entering into our country so this uh, wireless integrated network sensor will require a microwatt of power it is a advanced technology okay it is a cheaper when compared to the other security system such as radar it is a major advantage of this wireless integrated network sensors what are the application of wireless integrated network sensor mean for security purpose only it is a somewhat cheaper technology so it produces a less amount of delay noise detection image processing biometric scanning thermal detection are the main key roles of this wireless integrated network sensors and uh, evolution of wireless integrated network sensor this wireless integrated network sensor was initiated in 1993 under DARPA in US that is defense advanced research project A agency in 1993 it was initiated in 1993 under DARPA so it is a means it is a wireless integrated network sensor so it is the wireless integrated network sensor means it is the integration of it is the combination of different types of the sensors let us discuss what are the various types of sensors in upcoming slides so here we are having LWIM that is low power wireless integrated micro sensor program began in 1995 for further development of wins in 1998 it is so, so sorry it is a LWIM node so for improvement of uh, these wins we are uh, actually we are using this LWIM node in 1998 wins introduced for wide variety of applications such as multi hop communication self assembled wireless network algorithms for operating it micro power levels all these things so it was initiated in this idea will come under 1993 so by using LWIM this program will begin in 1995 for further development of wins okay so what is the working principle of this wins how can we work with this wireless integrated network sensor suppose consider one area here I am considering one border area our country so consider any area first of all we have to divide that uh, total area into number of nodes we have to divide the area into number of nodes and each node is in contact with uh, another node we have to connect one node with another and all these are nodes are controlled by the main node and noise produced by food step of the stranger are collected by using this uh, wireless integrated network sensor and this uh, sensitive signal is converted into power spectral density and compared with the reference value of our convenience already we are uh, fed some re re reference value to the system so if the reference value is not matched with the sensitive value it can easily detect uh, the stranger is entered into our area so it can give just it can give the alert so the stranger has entered into our area 
ओके आलरे वी आर् फीडिंग सम रेफरेन्स वाल्यू टू अवर् सिस्टम इफ द रेफर वाल्यू इज नाट मैच वित् द सेड वाल्यू सो इट कैन गिव दट अलर्ट टू दूसर दट अलर्ट विल बी सम स्टेजर विल एंटरी इन टू अवर बॉर्डर और स्टेजर विल एंटर अवर एरिया सो दिस कंपेर्ड वाल्यू इज अगेन प्रोसेसिंग यूजिंग मैक्रो प्रोसेसर अंड से टू द मेन यू सो फॉर् वर्किंग प्रिंसिपल लेट अस सी दिस डायग्राम सो कंसिडर दिस इज वन एरिया This area is divided into number of nodes like this. So each node having a uh, connection with another node. So all these nodes are connected by using one main node. It is a intermediate node actually. This intermediate node having the uh, link of a internet. By using the internet, the user can access the information. If a stranger, if a stranger enter into this area. the uh, some this user has already have some uh, reference value if a stranger enter into this area it can the sensors will easily detect the foot steps of this uh, stranger so it will immediately send the information to the main node and this uh, for by using internet the user can identify the foot steps of the stranger uh, stranger if the uh, this reference value is matched with this sensed value okay the the user can understand that uh, there is no thing uh, there is uh, nothing will be happen in wireless uh, uh, in in that particular area if the uh, uh, reference value is not uh, is not uh, matched with the sensed value the user can understand there is something will happen in that area and that the user can immediately understand and he can take the further steps so it is the actual the distribution of wireless integrated network sensors okay it is a overview or working of wireless integrated network sensor if are mainly simple thing if reference value is matched with already the user has some reference value if reference value is matched with sensed value there is no operation will takes place by the user if the, the reference value is not matched with this uh, sensed value the user can take the further steps okay that means he can abstract the entering of the stranger into the area okay it is a simple thing it is a simple friends working principle involved in wireless integrated network sensor remember this so what is the architecture of wireless integrated network sensor so architecture mainly consists of sensor adc it will sense the input uh, adc and up to digital converter spectrum analyzer buffer controller and then we are having wireless network interface okay this is useful for continuous operation it is useful for uh, low duty cycle operation so okay mm, and next one it supports a large number of sensors in a local area with a short range and uh, low average bitrate communication so it is the architecture of wireless integrated network sensor so it is a working of wireless integrated network sensor so we can it is the node architecture consider this is the area all these are the number of nodes and each and every node has connection with the another node all these are nodes are connected with each other and all these nodes are having a connection with the main node so this wireless integrated network is a low cost it can it is a low cost it consumes low power it supports multi hop communication it is uh, reconfigurable okay and next one what are the various sensors involved in the wireless integrated network sensor integrated means some sensor are integrated some sensor it is the combination of the different sensor the different kinds of sensors are the ugs unattended ground sensor and seismic acoustic sensor etc what is the ugs the ugs purpose is target detection target location and target information these are the various kinds of the sensors involved in wireless integrated network sensor and seismic sensor it gives an information about the stranger acoustic sensor it will test or detect the sound wave and determine the nature and distance of the sound okay these are the different kinds of the sensors boards so it is a wireless integrated network sensor so all these sensors are packed and we can get one type of sensor that sensor we can call it as a wireless integrated network sensor so these wireless integrated network sensor these kinds of sensors are placed in the area for for the security purpose actually 
so it is a combination of the different sensors all these are the different sensor boards that is mica sensor board it is a mica network board it is mica sensor board mica power board it is a twr i radar board it is all these boards are attached together and form one sensor that is wireless integrated network sensor and next one what are the monitoring tools of wireless integrated network sensor we have different kinds of tools available those are manual tools available for monitoring purpose automatic tools like uh, main node consists of this server that means uh, this main node the, it is the main node this main node will consists of the server and digital signal processor dsp signal processor chip microprocessor etc and what are the servers that we are going to employ in this wireless integrated network sensor monitoring the sensors are the sensor data server it is used for processing of the data sensor alert server it give alert after comparing data with the reference data this sensor alert server will give alert to the user if uh, sensed value is not matched with the reference value and the sensor data storage it store data for future reference and uh, wins digital signal processing what is the application of digital signal processing in a wireless integrated network sensor how digital signal processing is useful in case of a wireless integrated network sensors if a stranger enters to the border or some area his foot steps will generate the some signals so these signals are analyzed by using this spectrum analyzer so the signals will must be converted into the foot steps will convert it this type of this spectrum and this spectrum will be analyzed by using different type of the tools so the spectrum analyzer resolves the wins input data into a low resolution power spectrum what happening here means this stranger foot steps will convert into harmonic signals these harmonic signals will just acts like a spectrum and we can analyze this spectrum after that we can um, come to one solution okay it is a uh, application of digital signal processing in case of a wireless integrated network sensor operation and next one what is the need of wireless integrated network sensors it will reduce the human involvement in the border patrolling so we can reduce the number of uh, soldiers in the border if you employ these kinds of wireless integrated network sensors and it can also obstruct the illegal immigration trafficking of drugs and weapons into our country it also reduce organized crime and terrorism by if you use this wireless integrated network sensor we can easily uh, reduce the human involvement in the border patrolling okay what are the characteristics and applications wins support large number of sensor those are acoustic sensors or and sound sensor different types of sensor we had already discussed now so it support large number of sensors it give internet access to sensors controls and processor on a global scale wins will permit monitoring of land water air and resources it will not only monitor the land it will not only monitor some particular area it also monitor the water air anything it can monitor so that is the speciality of wireless integrated network sensor it will provide a good security with low price on a national scale transportation systems and borders will be monitored for efficiency safety as well as security so it has some disadvantage also every system are uh, some advantages and disadvantages these are also some disadvantages those are it is very easy for the hackers to hack it as we can't control the propagation of the waves it is somewhat some it is somewhat it is somewhat the disadvantage involved in case of a wireless integrated network sensor it is comparatively some low speed of communication okay so now it is possible to secure the border with an invisible wall of thousands or even billions of tiny integrated sensors by using these sensors we can easily protect our border we can reduce the soldier involvement in our but it is the major application it is the advanced application of wireless integrated network sensors so thank you